Seven, here's a resolution. 17. I mean, 17. I'll get with it. <laughs> <laughs> what happens when you're out for a week or in the case of uh, discussion? <clears throat> Favorite pose? I'm curious. Okay, item 22 is an ordinance. Discussion? Favorite pose? I'm curious. Item 24 is an ordinance. Discussion, I'll also be voting no for obvious reasons on number 24, but I want to talk about this, uh, the good in this item. There will be specific language in the agreement that allows amendment to the agreement to add one or more governmental entities, including not limited to Harris County as a joint sponsor of the corporation. That's good, but it's still not being done together. Say, Sloan Steady wins the race. But <laughs> understood. I'm moving to a vote. Favoring? Opposed? No. I'm curious, Councilman Christie voting no. Item 29 is an order. Discussion? Councilman Christie? I'm sorry. Just, you, you just got some hot items on okay. here today. Um, I just want to make a recommendation on this. Uh, <clears throat> the efficiency audit, it, it, it's definitely uh, needed. Fortune Magazine had us uh, ranked behind Massachusetts, California, Washington, and New York on uh, energy use. And they, there's some software out called Energy Points and it takes uh, the BTU kilowatt hours and converts it to an energy point. So you take biomass, wind, solar, gasoline, diesel, and you put it in, and you have city's usage into energy points, but there's softwares to make it efficient. I just hope that the company that we're given the contract to uses this software to where we don't fall in behind energy use uh, behind Massachusetts, California, Washington, and New York. That's a February article in Fortune magazine. So I just exhort this company to utilize this software to analyze our energy points. Council Member, if I may, there, there's more than one way to get to exactly where you want to go, and that's what we're trying to do. We have done energy efficiency audits. We have piloted uh, in, in uh, this building and 611 Walker, and rather than um, doing that same intense work in every city facility, we're taking first among the things we're doing is taking what we've learned from the, the first buildings we've done and going ahead and making those adjustments. We think we, we can make big gains and then come back and uh, more refine. But there's more than one uh, program that uh, moves us in that direction. And again, if I, I'd be happy to ask the appropriate city departments to update you on our progress. Further discussion? Seeing none, we'll move to the vote. Favor? Opposed? I'm curious. Okay. Item 31 is an order. Discussion? Favoring? Opposed? I'm curious. Item 33 is an order. Take my customer last one. Item 36 is an ordinance. Discussion? <laughs> okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Councilman Castello's name popped up on there. He's not here. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no discussion. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
42. And I know in the past I've been um, looking at the women minorities and small businesses and we've, we've hit it. Um, they've hit their goals, the contract, the, the goal that we were, we've been talking about. And even on number uh, 40, I think it's 40, yeah, 41, they went uh, above and beyond. And so it's, uh, I, you know, I, I speak on it when we're not hitting the goal. And uh, you know, tell the contractors thank them and thank them for going out with a good faith estimate when we do hit our goal. So, uh, and thank OBO at this point for monitoring. Thank you, Councilman. Further discussion on item 42? Moving to a vote. Favor, opposed, Discussion? Favor, opposed, Item 44. Item 46 has an ordinance. Discussion? Okay. Protect by 